Hey there, Gemini. Welcome to Friday. Well, partly sunny and rather blah, I think, this weekend. For the Geminis, the moon is in Pisces, and it will strike what I call a Bermuda Triangle. So I definitely think you Geminis are going to be in your twin heads, talking and thinking a lot, inside or out. But with the moon in Pisces, it puts emotional focus on your career and legacy. So you might be having feelings about your career. And as the moon crosses Uranus, it may be a leap of faith or test of faith that everything in your career will work out. Now, Uranus is direct, so the universe is going to start constantly testing you on your faith in your career. A lot, basically. And the reason why it's constantly testing you is to keep you moving. You don't want to get stuck anywhere. The universe is moving forward. Opposing Uranus is Saturn, so they're doing a tug of war. Saturn, of course, is, telling the Gemini, is saying to Geminis, it's time to grow up, it's time to take responsibility for your survival, which includes your home and your family and your childhood issues and any issues you have in your family. So really opposing the two are this effort to move forward with your foundation and constantly have faith that everything will work out in your career at the end of the day. Now, adding fear to the equation is the Sun in Sagittarius. We're in Chapter 2 now, and the Sun is squaring both of these planets, so I call that a Bermuda Triangle. Now, the Sun in Sag is saying to Geminis, time to move forward with a new relations policy, the way you relate to yourself, the way you relate to a world. But what you may find is fears bubble up in this whole context of relations between can you relate when it comes to having faith in your career? Can you relate and be good to yourself when it comes to taking responsibility for your foundation? Fears come up during a square transit. That said, if fears do come up, Gemini, the best approach is to just tackle them. Either eliminate them immediately by creating a solution right there in the moment that will kill the fear, or write down the fear and write down your solution. That alone will take responsibility away from the fear and back into your own hands. All right, Gemini, that's all I got for the weekend forecast. Be back on Monday. Live, love, be. Hello, Christopher Wataki here, your friendly neighborhood astrologer. Soul Garden is trying to raise some soul capital for us to expand our website, our content, and our soul services to you. So we're asking our viewers for donations. If you have a little extra soul capital of your own, you want to be part of this magical process, us preparing for the age of Aquarius, then please navigate to soulgarden.tv forward slash love forward slash live love be.